Hi everyone, and thank you for joining me for today's video. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, today I thought I would go through and show you our favorite printable resource for ages 2 to 4. It's the preschool learning folder from teacherspayteachers.com. We'll have a link down below. Um, it's a great resource. It did take quite a bit of time to put together because everything needs to be cut out and laminated so it actually lasts a long time. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we love it and I hope you enjoy it. Ellie always likes to flip through the book to pick out what she would like to work on for that day. Normally, if she doesn't need to work on one thing over the other, I kind of just let her pick whatever she's feeling like doing that day. The crayon um, little color matching page is definitely one of her favorites. Even though she already knows her colors, she just thinks the crayons are adorable. <laughs> This is another page that she really likes doing. It's the beginning letter sounds page. And it's taking all the letters and matching up to the pictures. And so normally what she does is takes them all off and then I give her a picture and she finds the letter that goes with that sound. This is the complete flip through through the learning folder. And the first page of course is the crayons that Ellie was doing earlier. And I just put little um, back to back Velcro pieces on the back of it all. Um, as you can tell, there's just a lot of pages. It does take a lot of time to put together, but it's really worth it in my opinion. So after the crayons, we have the I Know My Shapes page, which is another one of her favorites. We have the I See the Different Sizes page, and you can kind of point out what the different sizes are. Then we have I Can Match the Pictures, and underneath is the same picture that they have to match up. I did not cut apart all 26 of these letters. It would have been a lot and I didn't have that much time. So instead I created these little wood chips and I have her um, put the little wood chips on the letters that I give her. The next we have like a beginning counting page with apples. It's really cute. They just have to put the correct amount of apples in the right basket. And then next we have the I can count to 10 page. And then after that is the I can match the rhyming words. Then we have the I know my vowel sounds. This is really a cute way to teach them their vowels. And then after that we have I can match the letters. It's a really good way to match all the lowercase letters. 
and then I know my beginning sounds like the um, one that Ellie was doing earlier that page and then on the next page is just the rest of the beginning sounds letters after that we have I can match my numbers this is also a really fun page that she enjoys and then we have the calendar songs. We have the four season songs, months of the year songs, and three days of the week. Also a really fun way to memorize all those important things. And then we have I know the days of the week, and this is really fun for them to put the different um, days on what today is, yesterday, and then what tomorrow will be. Next we have the I Know the Months of the Year page, which is also really fun. And underneath each actual month is the holiday, or a picture that is relative to the holiday. Then next we have I Know the Weather, and this is always fun because she always likes going to this and picking out the type of items needed for that day depending on the weather. Next is the I Know Parts of the Flower page. This is one of my favorites. I normally take all the terms off and then when I call out or name the part of the plant, they label it again. And then I know my money amounts, another really fun way for them to learn the value of just coins and dollars. This was another page that actually had all the little individual coins that we had cut out and laminated. And I didn't have time to do that, so I just added in my own bag of the learning resources, Play Money. And then next is the I Know What Time It Is little um, clock and digital clock time page. The next is I Can Dial My Phone Number page. Again, a really important page for them to know. And another a favorite of mine is I Know the Life Cycle of a Plant. And then the last page is the census chart where they go through and learn about their five senses. That is the entire book. There are some pages, like I said, that I didn't include that require just too much time to cut out and laminate. Um, but overall, yeah, it's a really good book. We highly recommend it. Thank you guys so much for joining me and before you go um, don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you haven't and we will see you in our next video <laughs> bye